So let's talk about the step counter accuracy of the new Garmin Instinct 2. And honestly, I'm kind of disappointed in the Instinct 2 and the step counter isn't that accurate. So I have tested it uh, for around a week now and I also compared it to Galaxy Watch and also an Apple Watch as well as an older Garmin watch, which is a couple of years older than this one. So, uh, and these are the results I got. I covered all, almost uh, 40,000 steps when wearing this watch and also my Galaxy watch and also sometimes the Apple watch at the same time. And I have tested this uh, Galaxy watch in past compared to many other watches and it's the most accurate step count tracker of them all. Also, I compared um, the step counter uh, versus uh, manually counting the steps. So, I walked several thousand and walked, uh, calculated manually the steps. And these are the results, basically, what I got on the Instinct 2. So, when you are doing a long walk and uh, basically just walk for uh, go for a walk basically outdoors and yeah it's fairly accurate only two percent undercount uh, and that's really not hard for any watch basically and all of them pretty much do a good job well maybe the older garments didn't do uh, such a good job for this one does a good job however the problem starts when you are wearing this watch around your house and doing just basically like uh, any activity such as just walking uh, from one room to another room doing some household chores basically maybe working outdoors or uh, walking at your yard but basically you start uh, start walking walk some 20 steps and stop then walk 30 steps more and stuff like that while also doing something in the meantime and yeah this is where the Garmin Instinct 2 really struggles. So while manually uh, I was counting 2000 steps in my head basically while I was wearing the Garmin Instinct 2 and I got a uh, minus 38% uh, of the steps so it uh, yeah it undercounted by minus 38% and that's a huge huge mistake. In the mixed, uh, mixed basically situations where you basically wear my Galaxy watch along uh, with this one and just uh, wear for a few days and compare the results. The total inaccuracy of the Garmin Instinct 2 is around 31%. Of course this number isn't fixed and it will basically vary depending on what you do during the day as because uh, during a long walks it's accurate obviously but it really struggles during daily activities and honestly uh, most of your steps actually get clocked in during these basic everyday activities it's like just walking around the house working outdoors or stuff like that so it's very very bad for the garden instinct too and the total result gets yeah it's it's garbage basically compared to the Galaxy Watch or the Apple Watch. Uh, from my previous tests, the Galaxy Watch as a total error is only 3%. The Apple Watch is a bit worse at around 8%, but it's still very usable and the Apple Watch also is fairly good. Uh, the Fitbit, for example, has a similar error like this. However, it uh, overcounts by around the same uh, amount. So it provides actually more steps than you actually take. Uh, however, I find the problem, this uh, basically even if they have the same kind of error, this is much worse because it doesn't accurately uh, shows you your daily activity levels. Because this one, even if it overcounts, you can still judge your activities levels a uh, much more in basically better way than this one. So overall, I'm highly disappointed in the Garmin Instinct 2 and it, it's basically one of the worst uh, step counter results I have ever tested on any smartwatch. And it's basically similar to very cheap and uh, Xiaomi and Amazfit watches, which also has a similar error and they undercount a lot as well in those tricky situations. 
when you compare the results of long walk uh, uh, accuracy, it's actually better than the older garments because the older garments even struggled over there as well uh, when you're just walking in a straight distance for a long walk. So they weren't that accurate as well. For this one at least for that is fairly okay. Anyway, if this was helpful, make sure to hit the like button.